Arc Matter here. Okay, it's Saturday, and I wanted to cover a couple things real quick. Next book is booting up, and I have KitKat installed on it, and I thought I had the web page saved for um, installing it, but I guess I accidentally must have closed it on my way setting up today. But just to let you know that KitKat is on it, it it easy it it. Well, uh, <laughs> It is easy to get to. Um, you just go to next book and put it in the Google and uh, punch it in there. Um, and just what I did was I went to their web page and um, and I installed it. I don't know if you can see it. I can zoom in for a second here. And uh, there you can see right there in the corner is up here is the is the image file for it right there so um, what I did what you do is you just take your USB cord and um, you just run it your USB cord uh, plug it into your next book and it works um, you just take it and pick it up like this and just it'll come up on your um, computer and uh, you can install it. It's easy to do. What, well, what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna go. You know what? I'm gonna pause the video for just a second. I'm gonna get my USB cord, and I'll show you exactly how I did it. Okay, so I'm back. I'm back. 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 Um, I went and got my micro USB cable, and right now you can see that I'm on the. Um, well, let me back up just a little. <laughs> do do do. Sorry. There is the next book. Um, homepage. Uh, it's www.nextbookstores.com. www.nextbookstores.com. But you can also just go in and, of course, all you should know how to do, you should be able to, um, let's see, it was downloads? Yeah, it was downloads. I think it was downloads. Uh, yeah. It, it was it was a download and down, in the download page. I'm um, you just went and uh, grabbed it from the bottom. I don't know why I can't speak correctly. Maybe it's just because I don't really want to do this today. But oh well, here we are. Um, but uh, let me go to my settings real quick. And uh, for those of you who didn't see that, I showed it the other day uh, about tablet and and there it is. There's the KitKat. And there it is. See, so I have KitKat, and at the bottom you can see it says Android 442. So there it is. It's very simple install. Um, like I said, I, you just take your USB micro USB cable, take your micro USB cable. Um, I'm gonna turn this off real quick. Um, take it and uh, take it and plug it into the tablet. I can see what I'm doing. there. Take it and you plug it into the tablet and USB connected. Of course, up in the corner there, you can see I've already installed an Android um, KitKat, so it's up there in the corner telling me that it's an updated so software version. Um, you turn on your USB storage. So I turned it on, and uh, if I shrink down here. It's identifying, as you can see, it's identifying there at the top that it is the tablet's installed up there. And there, I'll zoom in a little closer. There it is, it's showing there's the tablet. Then, let's close it. Right there's my, my image up in the corner that I showed you, which was my uh, the image uh, is right there. There's the image, the image file. And then you open up your computer. Uh, there it is. And all you have to do, uh, let me zoom back just a little. And zoom back just a little. Uh, the, the file's over here. The image file's right here. You just take it, which I'm not going to do it because it's already installed, but I'm just going to, like a run through, is I'm going to unplug and turn off USB storage. But that's going to go away. But what you would do if the window was up uh, is you would just take the 
that file and you would just you would just drop that file into um, the tablet it doesn't have to be in a specific folder you just draw I just went all the way down through the Android thing here I'll hook it back up so I can show you that again but um, Come on. All right. So there it is again. Plugged in. Oop. All right. Turn USB bugging on. USB mass storage connected. It'll come up on here again. And it'll find it. There it is, telling me that the tablet's connected. And then I just click on this. Okay. I just scrolled all the way down here. Um, I just took the update and I just dropped it right in there. Right, I just downloaded it, dropped it right in here at the bottom. In, anywhere in here it does not have to be in a specific folder at all. Uh, and then um, here is the download. And you go all the way to the bottom. You don't have to select anything. All the way to the bottom. And oh wait, maybe I did uh the yeah, what was this one? Uh, firmware downloads on the updates, firmware downloads on the updates. Yes, that's what I did. So it'll go to that. And all I did was take the image file and I dropped it in. I completely shut off the tablet, rebooted it, and boom, there it is. There's the install. It came up and as you can see it is on KitKat now, so but uh go home and of course I was talking the other day when I was playing I was playing a game too so oh yeah I wanted to go uh, anti to benchmark and to to benchmark it got really good scores uh, there's the scores for n to to benchmark 19914 not bad at all um, the details were good support, large apps, multitasking, RAM, excellent 2D graphics, excellent 3D graphics, good fluently supports most games, which is great. So if you're younger or whatever, plus it's got the book stuff, but uh, you can, uh, you know, go there. So once you go to the next book uh, page and you'll see firmware updates is what you select on the bottom. You go there, firmware updates, you go all the way down to here. This one's the one you want right here. If you can see, I'm circling this with my mouse, and maybe I'll just zoom in just a little. Uh, you can see I'm circling this with my mouse. This is the one you want right here, that one. Uh, download it, put it on your desktop. It's for the NX785QCHE, NX785QC8G. You download that to your desktop like I did, and boom, you just drop it in your tablet, and it'll reboot. And that's as easy as it goes. You have KitKat on your next book, and it, it seems to be running smooth right now. It should with quad core. Yeah. <laughs> it should with quad core, and I think you can all agree with that. But there it is. That again. Um, so far, I've been playing around with it. I've been very impressed with it. Um, let me go through the uh, other thing on the N22, which I usually do. So um, go back. All right, device info. Then I usually go down here. Now, the one thing I did notice, a lot of the um, other things I usually go through, which is like the direction sensor, G sensor, were supported, but when I went to KitKat, they are unsupported now. Uh, so, detection sensor is not supported, G sensor is not supported, acceleration sensor supported, uh, light sensor not supported, e compass not supported, proximity sensor not supported, geo. Gyro, excuse me, gyro sensor not supported, temperature sensor not supported, pressure sensor not supported, ambient temp. Sensor not supported. Relative humidity sensor not supported. Linear acceleration sensor not supported. Rotation vector sensor not supported. Now a lot of these were supported on Jelly Bean, uh, but I went to KitKat and they weren't. Uh, it doesn't seem to really affect the um, tablet that much as of yet uh, because I've been playing uh, this um, shark game, Hungry Shark, and uh, it's been it's been doing really well. I mean I haven't had too many problems at all so. And here's the company. Here you go. A shout out to these guys for the game. Uh, yeah, Shark Week, Sunday, August 10th. Thing. And then you just got to kind of touch it a little bit. It'll go away. So, and you'll get to your game. So, get to my game. 
So there it is, Hungry Shark Evolution, and saw you some of you saw some of you saw me playing it the other day, but I wanted to want to hurry up and yeah, we'll go home. Uh, I just want to hurry up and finish my tablet review. Uh, there it is. There's the next book with Kit Kat. If you have any comments or questions, go ahead and ask ask me. Um, please like, please subscribe. Um, also, welcome all new subscribers, all old subscribers. Thank you for hanging in there. Uh, anybody else that wants to join in my little row, 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 you broke program of uh, nonsense on my on not completely weird nonsense of my channel, come on in. Let's let's have some fun. Uh, comment me uh, on the tablet if you have any problems. I'm trying to help a few. Uh, somebody said they couldn't get couldn't get Kit Kat to load on the tablet. Make sure you looking at the right. It's the first one, not any of the bottom ones. But that's not the tablet you have. But this is the tablet. Make sure you always check your serial number to match up with your firmware update uh, for flashing and everything, so it does it properly. But until Wednesday, which will be more babbling, babble, babble, babble by me, babbling here. And uh, what else can I get into? Um, in my quest to quit my job by doing my YouTube videos, but I need more subscribers. Anybody out there, find subscribers, bring them in, hang, let's hang out, uh, comment, let's try to do some different things. I'm trying to change my channel. Uh, I was trying to grow it a little bit more than just all Android. I'm trying to grow into more geekiness of other things. And I've also threw in a couple crazy weird little videos besides what I normally you do to show how diverse I'm trying to be. So until Wednesday, please like, here, I'll just use my regular thumb. I can't find my other ones right now. <laughs> please like, please subscribe. And I will see you Wednesday, Wednesday, with a Wednesday vlog, Wednesday vlog, and I'll be here. So, until then, thanks for watching.